Imagine this. Every time you take a shower, wash your dishes, or flush the toilet, water flows down the drain, carrying dirt, soap, and everything else we've used. But have you ever wondered where all that dirty water goes? It doesn't just disappear. It gets cleaned up in a process that makes it safe to go back into rivers, lakes, or even the ocean. Today, we're going to dive into how a wastewater treatment plant works. Let's explore how it transforms dirty water into something clean again. It all starts when wastewater, yes, the water we use daily, flows into a giant system of pipes like a water highway that carries it straight to a treatment plant. Think of it like a big underground network that collects the water from all the homes, schools, factories, and offices. Once the water arrives at the treatment plant, it first goes through something called screening. Imagine giant nets that catch all the big things, like plastic bottles, sticks, and even food scraps that shouldn't be in the water. After that, the water goes into a grit chamber where heavy stuff like sand and small rocks sink to the bottom. Next, the water enters huge settling tanks. Here, things slow down. The water just sits for a while, and the bigger particles like food scraps, oils, and grease sink to the bottom. The solids are scooped up and sent somewhere else to be taken care of while the cleaner water moves on. Now, it's time for the magic to happen. The water enters aeration tanks where special bacteria and microorganisms get to work. These tiny creatures love to eat up the leftover organic stuff in the water, like food, oils, and other pollutants. As they break it down, the water gets cleaner and cleaner. In some places, the water goes through an extra step called tertiary treatment. This is like a final checkup for the water. Here, the water is passed through sand filters or even treated with chemicals to make sure there's nothing left that could harm the environment. Now, the water is almost ready. The final step is to disinfect it just to be sure it's completely safe. Some treatment plants use chlorine, while others use ultraviolet, UV light, to zap away any remaining bacteria or germs. This step makes sure the water is 100% safe for nature, and there you have it. After all these stages, the water is finally clean and safe. It's released back into rivers, lakes, or the ocean, where it becomes part of nature again. But what happens to all the solid stuff that was removed? It gets processed into useful things, like compost or even energy. Wastewater treatment is an incredible process that helps keep our planet clean and healthy. So next time you turn on the tap or flush the toilet, remember, your dirty water is going on an amazing journey to become clean once more.